back of the room and they're fucking Digimon. Agunamon, pretty sexy. Sephirmon, also sexy. Cutemon, looks up to its name. Renamon is the sexiest one of them all. Furries hanging in the side of the room and they're fighting Digimon. Furries move into the back of the room and they're fucking Digimon. Can we talk for a bit about Boots's just gnarly guitar tone in yeah, that song? That, was really good. Uh, it's, it's, that should be the new theme song, honestly. Oh, Besides, everyone knows Kiwimon is the sexiest Digimon. So, here we go. We have. This... Is there. Yes. Sorry. Yes. Is there really like a Digimon name? And is there from... really one named Cutemon? Kiwimon. Not Cutemon. Oh, I, I thought he said cute. Cute Cutemon lives up to its name. <laughs> No. Better than so, ugly mine. <laughs> so we are going to be reading about Renamon. Uh, hopefully, Lemon will be putting a picture of the actual Renamon on there. Renamon is a oh, character yes, from the Digimon series uh, of games, and that is not what Renamon <laughs> looks, looks like. Perhaps what Renamon if you bring like. her to a boy I, I don't know. It seems pretty fuckable to me. Yeah, she, <laughs> <laughs> she's a fox monster um, who uh, does not actually. <laughs> have a particularly sexualized uh, design, that's fine. Um, but right now we have... Let's see, who is who is in here? I'm going to check real quick. We got sure Lemon, we got, we got Friedman, we've to, got to look like Nutshell, that. we've got Isfahan, we've got Toast, we've got mm-hmm. Zarla's just kind of hanging out, that's fine. Frank's yep. playing <laughs> this Digimon kart racer that I don't think actually has... Um, Renamon in it, but that's fine. And also, uh, last time when we were reading about Pokemon, uh, I put Guzzlord into the soundboard. This time, I put in uh, the Finnish dub of TK into the soundboard. So, TK, announce yourself. So, feel free to use that. It's under the name Finnish Digimon. <laughs> Press them as much as you want. I'm so sad that Mantra th- just left. Yeah, she just missed it. <laughs> just voiced by Mantra. She's still here. That's her. Time. That's her <laughs> voice. The character. So we have the uh, the doc here. Um, some people I've I've been told that some people in this room have not watched that many seasons of D- Digimon. Hmm. Um, so Get JW Friedman, it. can you read me the definition of Renamon at the uh, oh, beginning hang of the on. Here? I'm 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 still pulling up the doc. I'm sorry. Oh, that's um, fine. Perhaps somebody else should do it. All right, we can do that. Lemon, you want to tell us who Renamon is? The definition of Renamon from Urban Dictionary. Yeah, yeah. The and definition... what, what is your name, by the way? Well, there, oh, come on, come on. Look, if you're going <laughs> to oh. want to know the definition of Renamon, you should get it from me, XX Renamon Lover XX. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That name is trustworthy. It's a killer gamer tag right there. <laughs> I'm a, a Renamon lover, not a Renamon fighter. <laughs> okay. So the definition of Renamon, the reason why Digimon is a well-known series. She is extremely good looking. I need you all to just look at the stream. <laughs> That around, like around whatever garbage ass Mario Kart <laughs> Frank West is playing to this extremely good looking uh, person or thing object Digimon uh, can make any straight male furry a furry because she is just that gorgeous and hot. If I'm not Ooh. mistaking actively right now, she <laughs> has the power to use crystals to attack foes with. Wow. Do they right. and, and could, could you use Renamon in a sentence or yeah, perhaps, totally. or perhaps yeah. a short one act play? Yeah, no, I'm good at writing, Renamon mm-hmm. lover, me. Um, can, I, so, can I be person? Yeah, sure, absolutely. <laughs> you be person, yeah. Oh, hi, <laughs> welcome to my room, person. Hi, I'm person. Hey, uh, what the hell is that on your desktop? No, that's Renamon. She is a sexy bipedal from Digimon <laughs> and the sole reason why it's popular. Uh, I mean, find the lie. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're a furry. Bipedal. You, you're a furry. <laughs> I didn't know Renamon was a girl. <laughs> so she is a guest. The, 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 the Clear, I mean, look at that image. Look at that. <laughs> clearly, can't that you screen. tell? It's a very sexy girl. Sexy, sexy uh, girl. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, 
I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, John Toast. I need to get my line back. I just need to really get back in there. Uh, can you give me that line again? You, you're a furry. Okay, I've got my finger in your chest now. <laughs> <laughs> If jerking off to a sexy and gorgeous girl like Renamon makes me a furry, then I am a damn furry. <laughs> the flag the American flag. Yeah, the American flag. <laughs> flag like, battle him in the public starts playing. <laughs> I would kill to have a girl like her to live with the rest of my life. You got a problem with that? I've, I've uh, already walked away. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> just, just gently stroking the monitor <laughs> fingertips all right so um wait there's... Why, why did slime just appear in this video that's game? new maimon <laughs> they live in the sewer and they throw poop at people all right oh, are they the ones that <laughs> oh no there's actually like there's actually like poop yeah Mons they throw pink too. poop poop oh, yeah. all right all right all right you're all right. the champions um <laughs> Uncle Mon or something. Yeah, so um this doc is gonna be pretty easy because a lot of this the main thing I want everyone to read is this long but very well typed uh fan fiction oh, God. Um, by cool. a guy named Shade. Cool. Um who apparently has made his own uh a an actual Renamon recolor OC do not steal uh Ooh. named Light <laughs> Renamon. Uh Light yeah. Renamon also just sometimes called Light. Um, there's also seems to be some sort of cat person that appears in the story, uh, as best I can tell, does not show up in Digimon. That's fine, we'll get to that in a bit. Excellent. But, um, yeah, so we'll just be trading off basically every page of this, I feel. Um, <laughs> okay. Zarla, if you can start us off, it's, uh, it's called A True Love, Shade and Light Renamon. You just read True this little love. highlighted in green section I've got here. Everything is highlighted in green. No, yeah, that's, no there's that's a lot of highlighting. There's a lot of science. No, right, yeah, right. there's a lot of highlighting. It's called a true love. True love. Okay. Shade just, and light, okay. Renamon. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. This is for me and light, Renamon only to. This is for me and light, Renamon only to get all converse, confusion out of the way. I don't know why I posted it. Uh, light sat on the rooftop of Alan's house, watching the stars up at the night sky, thinking about how the world has changed in her time with Alan. She hasn't seen Alan all day, which was a first for her, as she usually checks on him every now and then. But today, something was different, and she had avoided him, staying on the rooftop. It's the first period. <laughs> like, yeah. For yeah, the first can't get for a lot of that. Yeah, yeah. got to take a breath. Uh, for the first time, she didn't know what to do with herself, so she listened to the movements outside Alan's house, wondering what he was up to. Alan was in the training room, punching dummies and punch bags to keep his strang strang up. After the training, Alan wondered what Light was up to. She usually visits him training with something to drink. Alan put the towel around his neck and walked into the house looking for her, finally dis finally deciding to move. She jumped down from the rooftop to Alan's windowsill. Pushing the window open, she slipped inside to Alan's bedroom and left into the main hall. Alan's house was fairly big, but Light being here for just over a year now no knows her way around, though she still gets lost sometimes. And this is one of those times as she walked down a hallway she didn't wreck recognize opening a door to a right inside with a few chairs and a number of bookshelves good all right so isfahan you can take this next page and respect the red squigglies give them the gravitas <laughs> they deserve <laughs> I can't remember this room going back out into the hallway she looked down both <laughs> ways looking for a sign on where to go but not seeing one was just about to give a small shout when she saw a shadow moving all the way down the hall. Running down, she pounced on the shadow, not knowing who or what it was, and then released. It was realized it was Alan. Oh, sorry, she said in her quiet voice. Alan blinked twice and smiled. Got lost again, Light. How many times does that make now? Um, 54? I think. I thought you were something else like, um... An Itriuder or something. <laughs> Slowly gets off Alan and offers him a clawed hand to help him up. So, um, you hungry? <laughs> or thirsty, maybe? Hungry. 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 Hey, are you thirsty? <laughs> hungry. I can find the kitchen okay, that's for sure. She waved her long tail. Light really liked being useful to Alan, and she really enjoys it, tense shift. That be great, Light am straving. Oh. <laughs> Alan always liked uh, griefing. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I 
Yeah, Frank West is not the best at Digimon racing. I know. <laughs> He's coming in fourth. <laughs> Alan always liked Light Cherry Smile. Made him feel he, made him feel he was in a right place all the time. He really loves the fact that she leaps on him sometimes. He finds it funny. Okay. <laughs> um it won't be long. Light dashed down the corid corridor. Corridor. And, corridor. Yeah. Corridor. And jumped, <laughs> and jumped down the stairs to the kitchen. Opening ah! the <laughs> <laughs> Opening the cup bard. What's that Pokemon doing? Uh, hello, it is me, the cup bard. <laughs> I shall sing you the song of these cups. Uh... <laughs> she got a plate and a glass. And did uh... Alan his <laughs> Took out a plate and a glass and did Alan his food and a drink to go with it. Putting the plate and the glass on a tray, she slowly left the kitchen and walked up the stairs, her tail waving from side to side. When she got to the landing, she looked both ways, slightly confused, and then remembered, wow, nailed remembered, nice, to take the left path down, bringing Alan his food, placing it on a table. Here, hope you like it. She turned her gaze outside and looked at the sky as it darkened and the moon rose from the sky. Thanks, Light. Alan began eating as he enjoyed the tastes Light made <laughs> and noticed her <laughs> good tastes. She Alan's her... work. It's good. <laughs> and noticed her staring at the moon. On mm. a cooking show when it's like, so first enjoy the taste you made. <laughs> at that time, thought to himself the ta to take Light somewhere where she can view the full moon up close as possible. <laughs> Alan finished his meal and looked at her. That was good light, thanks. Um, sure, Alan. Alan? I've been meaning to ask you something now, since uh -huh. my time with you uh -huh. well. <laughs> Not everyone seems to like me. Why is that? <laughs> and Alan replied, some people just hate furries. <laughs> Her eyes still looking at the moon before she turned them to Alan in a casual... <laughs> in a casual... <laughs> <laughs> Hard hat slugshot uh, says it has been entirely too long since the bop, and I could not agree more. Uh, thank you, Hard hat slugshot. Yeah. Uh, and Alan replied. Yeah! I know. I, I know. I like, look at this. Like, look at how far we are out of fucking caregivers now. Like, everyone should be feeling a whole lot better. Yeah. I am feeling a hundred percent better. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah I, much I, better. I, in the break between, I said, I can't believe I'm looking forward to Renamon. <laughs> I am I am actually disgusted by Frank West playing, though. He's in fifth place right now. <laughs> I thought he was a gamer, but now he's Yeah, I thought he was a gamer. <laughs> really doing Agumon dirty there. There he is. He really is. <laughs> I wish I knew light. Maybe the air hate be you because you're possessive more bad. bad. place. Be too full, then you more them. Be too full. Be too full, <laughs> then them. Wrong then. Alan smiled at her while looking at her eyes. Aw, you're possessive sweet, Alan. But I noticed some humans outside don't seem to like me. Can I see the moon, Alan? Looking at it from the window isn't the same. You never know what a window is going to be <laughs> until you marry art and science for this era. <laughs> I want to be outside and look at it. Her time with Alan has taught her that Alan always says yes to her, no matter what she asked. If <laughs> Tense shifts in the sentence. There are still the odd thing that she doesn't understand, and there is some things that still confuses her. Sure, Light, I think I know a good spot where we can watch the moon. Alan knew that the air stuffs Light still confused at it, so he intends to help her as much as he can. <laughs> All right, good. Now JW Free McMahon, get your get your best anime voice going. This is super anime, <laughs> super cool anime shit happening. I think. Okay. Uh, Cat walking um, on keyboard says, "My taste bring all the sexy bipeds to the yard." <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty sexy biped. I want to see the moon. Get into my trebuchet. <laughs> I'll throw you up there. Fucking fling. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> That's the sound landing makes. Okay. Oh, oh! Apparently, there's a boss battle in this Digimon racing. Oh hell yeah! Come on, Frank, get to it. <laughs> it up again. He just needs to try another Digimon. That's it. He just hasn't found. Yeah, Agumon seems to suck. Yep, <laughs> and, and, look at that boss. <laughs> CG man. <laughs> hey, hey.
Thanks, Alan. Mm-hmm. I'll follow you anywhere. She smiled sweetly and looked up at Alan, her tail waving happily. Okay, let me get changed quickly and then we can head out. Alan dashed oh, cool. off and ran to his bedroom and took off his training cloths and replaced with his everyday outfit. Okay, I hope that place still exists. It's been a long time since I've been there. Light giggled as she followed Alan as he left the house. Walking behind Alan, she looked at the people who passed them. Some gave her and Alan a smile and a small nod, but others looked at her with disgust and hatred. Discoost and hatred. (laughs) Discoost. How far is it? Are we nearly there? Rushing up to catch Alan up. Not too far now, Light. We get there as soon as possibly. Alan smiled as he hit... As he contwined, leading the way. <laughs> it's a possibility um, freak out. <laughs> <laughs> possibility freak out! Um, okay, Alan, I'm right behind you. Light ignored most of the looks as most of them smiled at her, so she paid no attention to the ones that were giving her dark looks. Before she knew it, Alan had led her to a path where hardly anyone was around. Okay, just up this hill, Light, and we there. (laughs) Alan leads here up the hill, and once there got there, there both see the biggest moons. (laughs) What the fuck? (laughs) The moons are big. Yeah, just just rewinding a little bit here. Alan leads here up the hill, and once there got there, there both saw the biggest moon sight. <laughs> I've been here before when I had my powers for the first time. Cool instant. <laughs> it's so. What's the word? Unusual to actually see it outside like this. Can I touch it? Light asked. <laughs> Whoa. Light asked curiously. <laughs> you can try. Oh, no. You can try, but this moon is still out of reach. <laughs> Sit down okay. and watch as the moon. Sit down and watch. Sit down and watch as the moon said that, I guess. Yeah, you're yeah, gonna sit down reason. and you're gonna watch as the moon. <laughs> I like it. Thanks, Alan. She jumped up casual. Oh, wow. She jumped up casually. I'm getting excited when right. a word like that is spelled correctly. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> she, she jumped up casually and landed lightly on Alan's shoulders and jumped up, reaching for the moon, giggling as she landed back on the grass. I didn't think that would work, but I had to try. Sits, possessive, down, curling her tail around her. (laughs) Alan laughed it as he (laughs) laid down looking. (laughs) Alan laughed it as he laid down looking at the stars above him. I'm so called you're with me, Light. Most other Renamons like Alexandra always seem busy at the moment. Wait, there's more? (laughs) Wait, what? (laughs) Yeah, (laughs) there's there's multiples of them, I guess. Talk to the Renamon Guild. Lots of (laughs) Renamons. Is Renamon Renamon a a multiple? I just learned about multiples (laughs) a few hours ago. Am I talking to Renamon right now? (laughs) (laughs) There are many of us, but we are all Renamon. Alexandra has joined a fight club to get her sword skills improved. You can't tell people that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, don't talk, you don't talk about that. Though, no I don't think she it. needs it, if you ask me. And well, if I go anywhere by myself, I'll only get myself confused or lost, smiling thoughtfully to herself. I guess that's true. Well, I'm happy to be your guide. Light giggled at those word and looked up again, just in time to see a shooting star speed across the sky. Alan, that star is trying to... Sorry. Alan, that star is trying to get away. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, nutshell? Yes. I have a, Renam- I have a, a Digimon question. Is, sure. Is Renamon a childlike idiot in canon? No, she's not. She okay. actually she's, fights a lot. She's got kind of like a samurai, like, stoic personality in the show. Okay. Yeah. Mon is cool. So they're in- infantilizing Renamon? Yeah, they're, yeah. But this is their the original. Like an idiot. There's original Renamon. Their <laughs> That's true. I guess light Renamons are, are morons, I guess. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 boss. This is my That's idea. That's a shooting Renamon. starlight. Most people make a wish when they see one. Alan smiled. <laughs> then I wish everyone would get along and stop <laughs> fighting and no more wars oh, and. and I want to stay with you, Alan. Wait, that's three wishes. <laughs> Chuckling, she turned to Alan and gave her 
him her look that says that she knows he likes. Wait here, okay? Oh, oh my god. Alan lifted himself up to wondering what light is up to, too. Alan lay back down and watched the moon and stars until she arrives back. Rushing off, she headed back to down the path they came up and turned into a wild part of a small woodland full of trees. No, it's around here somewhere. Where is it? Where is it? Ah! Oh, there you are. Putting <laughs> out the microphone. Finally I'm... found what she was looking for. She picked up a fairly big, smooth stone <laughs> that glittered under the moonlight. Smiling, she... under the moonlight. Under the moonlight. Yes. Under the moonlight. <laughs> Smiling, <laughs> she came back blow. up the hill and dropped the stone <laughs> in Alan's lap. <laughs> I found this. It's pretty. I want you to have it. You're not leaving this place, Ellen. <laughs> Ellen You're going to get a real close stone. look at this stone soon. And looked at it and smiled. Thanks, Light. <laughs> I can't say. <laughs> how do you, how do you pronounce Alan. the two carrot anime okay. smiley face again? <laughs> <laughs> that is the face. That is the sound you make when you do anime things. Perfect. It's true. It feels very doughboy ass. Adorably at Alan, a cold wind rustled her fur, and she oh, shivered yeah. slightly. <laughs> Alan started to feel Shiffered. the cold and lift himself off the ground. Let's go back, Light. I don't want to catch a cold. He warmly smiled at her. Okay, I'll meet you back inside. I should know the way. Dashing off, leaving Alan behind, soon she found herself back into the town and stopped looking both ways. Oh, way. Turning, <laughs> she rushed down the street and stopped outside a fairly big house. <laughs> found it, I guess. I should wait for Alan. Uh, <laughs> whoa. Uh, Alan got up and walked back, not in a mood to run, as he took his chance to look at the stars. Having a good time, Alan? <laughs> Alan shit. turned his head just to see Blaze Dark Spire swinging in the shadows. Dark Spire. Oh, oh man, she sounds cool. I oh, looked up in oh, personnel, yeah. kid. <laughs> what do you I want? Up and this character does not exist seem to exist in the show, and I think he's also a cat. Yeah, yeah not, Google image not doing much with Blaze yeah. Darkspire here. Yeah, I, think, <laughs> I think he might just be a cat person of some sort. <laughs> what you want? Tuna fish, maybe? Ha <laughs> ha, Ellen! I came here to fight you as usually so I can get you out of the... Blaze stared at his blood red eye. <laughs> Alright, good. So for the for the thrilling conclusion, let's see. Has oh. anyone not read anything at all yet? I just want to make sure. Lemon. All right, good. Le all right, Lemon. Yeah, you only got to read a little bit. Here you go. Read the <laughs> read the thrilling, the thrilling gray part of. Yeah, the you bet. Yeah, bet. As yeah, the bet. rain fell, Alan <laughs> and Blaze looked at each other. Blaze lit his claws on fire. Oh, Ow. <laughs> as Alan <laughs> Ow, ow what? Dude, Why did I just As, <laughs> as Alan prepared himself And then somebody says You ready, Alan <laughs> And then somebody else says Anytime, pussy <laughs> That's a pun Anytime right? any time. My anytime, pussy <laughs> <laughs> Both leaped at each time. other and started to exchange blows. No, they stared. They stared to. They each stared to exchange. <laughs> blows. We're thinking really hard about it. It's like that fight between Stormo and Goliad in the. Maybe it's the evil version of the Trailblazers mascot, Blaze the Trail Cat. <laughs> Alexandra rushed up the grassy hill just in t just in time to see Alan fighting with Blaze. That's oh, another. No. I think oh, I no, I not again. Fox or something in the story. I said it was so another like, Renamon. I yeah, got I said it was another Renamon. So yeah, Renamon. second Fox. Yeah, yeah, she's, totally the classy, she's, she's the classy <laughs> Renamon. You have to have. She's the one in a fight Renamon. club. Yeah, she was, <laughs> like, she's <laughs> the one in the fight club. Sword yeah. skills in the fight club. Yeah, that's right. You know? yeah. You have to have the Ojo Renamon and the Sundere Renamon. And they all have to fight over the main character who's me. <laughs> <laughs> Turning to Alan, 
should know better than to fall bait to him. Light refuses to go inside and she's catching a cold, but she won't go in until you're with her. She greatly loves you. I would do voices if I knew what the fuck anything was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just do a pickle. Who was talking? Well, I'm sure it'll be fine. Somebody sure. talking. Blaze felt anorried. And without <laughs> warning, Alexandra. Oh, wait. Without warning, kicked Alexandra in the stomach. Hey! <laughs> Alan was about to jump in, thought about light, and held himself back and walked to Alexandra. <laughs> to see she was all right. Alexandra got up a little shaken by how her eyes locked on Blaze. One of her hands reached for a sword. You're not worth it, but next time... Uh, I guess just every voice is going to be Boots. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Seeing as how nothing's attributed, every what voice 90s anime boots. dubs kind of say. Yeah. Yeah, You're not fine. worth it, but next time... <laughs> Looking at Alan, she nodded at him with a quick smile. Thanks for your concern but I will be fine. That's good to hear. Now let's go <laughs> on and head back. Blaze lifting his claws on fire, about to attack <gasps> again. Don't you leave after our fight? <laughs> oh, shut up, you silly cat. <laughs> Alexandra oh, so spun giddy. around and walked back to Blaze, which is not capitalized, before he could do anything. Alexandra quickly sidestepped and kicked him in the stomach. <laughs> but oh. not done there. She also what? leapt in the air and drop kicked Blaze right in the back, ignoring Blaze. <laughs> she held Alan's hand, half leading him away from Blaze and half pulling him. Half uh huh. Away. Okay. Yeah. Wow. I, yeah. I can, yeah. I'm following it. <laughs> it was separated in half. <laughs> <laughs> uh, half pulling him as the rain came down harder. Finally, oh, they now. reached Alan's house, and there was Light falling asleep in the rain, leaning mm. on a post, still waiting for Alan. <laughs> He's just passed out, leaned up against like a tree or whatever. I want to go inside. Yeah, like I couldn't horse. figure out how to turn up. Yeah, but like with little like yeah. cartoon drunk bubbles coming out of the head. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alan walked up to her and picked up Alexander. You come in too and get yourself dry and stay with us for the night. Turning into Gomer Pile. <laughs> that, <laughs> Ollie. Ollie. <laughs> that said, Alan walked in and plays light in bed. Not the character, <laughs> just the concept, just the concept of, light. of light. Yeah, yeah. put a yeah. lamp. <laughs> Turn on the uh, flashlight on his phone. Tucked it in. <laughs> <laughs> I planned in doing just that, but I say, but I say, light can be silly sometimes. She will wait forever for you. <laughs> Alexandra turned to face Alan directly. You should get some sleep. Rest next to her and keep her warm, Alan. You wouldn't want her catching a cold. Ooh, Alexandra's wingmanning for light, I guess. <laughs> I know. She's too stupid to use a blanket. <laughs> Just fresh off drawn, quartering, drawing and quartering somebody or other. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and nodded and went to bed besides light, covering her fur with his arm and slowly <laughs> fall asleep. <laughs> Meanwhile, Blaze took shelter in an abandoned factory plane. Wait, wait. What, what kind no. of factory? Oh no! It's a, yeah, it's a regular old uh, factory that makes a a a bond a bondund. <laughs> a bondund. <laughs> it's a factory that makes a bondund. <laughs> Ooh, powerhouse! Blaze took shelter in a bondund factory, planning to murder Light just to get Alan to fight him. You want to know the best? The best uh, close of a story is a character sleeps. <laughs> yep. It's restful. The story was intense, so you gotta have a cool down. Yeah. <laughs> See, I mean, to tell, to it doesn't fair. matter how you do in the actual race part of this racing game. It just matters that you eat shit at the box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Angemon is not looking so good. He looks kind of like a plastic toy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <Right now. laughs> 
That's an angel. How dare you? <laughs> you gotta respect <laughs> it an like Twelve feet tall too. Oh, he turned back into pedal. Yeah, yeah a, 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 giant, a giant man. He no, is. Is, is, a, is my favorite pedal. Is my favorite mon. Yeah, <laughs> pedal is adorable. A little My, uh, with wings. As a fun <laughs> yeah, side note, exactly. um, guinea pig with with wings, your head wings. <laughs> as a fun side note, there is a male angel named Anjamon, and there is a female angel named Anjay Woman. Yeah, which really makes, which really delights me. Linda Dota to twenty five dollars saying good morning, sickos. Uh, <laughs> yes. Morning, so, Jamie <laughs> Friedman is, is apparently a new yeah, Renamon fan. Do you have a you have a poem for us? Mm. Um, mm. Yeah, I've been thinking a lot about Renamon, and um, this is this is what I've been thinking. Uh, this is called. Well, I've first of all, I've changed my name to VR Tsudu, and <laughs> okay. this is a Volpine goddess. She stands alone in a bitter night, and despite how try she might, thoughts of love do hold her mind, love by her own strength confined. Belief that heart will make you weak, mainly power does she seek, yet a heat surges deep inside, her heart mixes love in with her pride. So elegant, so dignified, from afar many have spied, such beauty and such power, she is the nighttime prowler. Wait. A perfect coat of yellow uh. fur. <laughs> She's killed and she'll kill again. She broke into my house. <laughs> Stole my jewelry. A perfect coat of yellow fur. The darkness seems to follow her. Alluring stalker of the night. Speed that matches that of flight. Great agile vulpine goddess. Beyond heavenly art thou blessed. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> <The> Sunday <laughs> spiked him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that alleged wound beneath thine eye. All who oppose you are soon to die. Violet <laughs> oh, yeah. gauntlets pulled up your arms. Claws suffused enemies to be harmed. Volpine goddess, she stands alone. In this bitter night, she stands all alone. <laughs> you can't do that. You're listening. You're listening to book notes. Up next, David Sedaris kicks mad freestyle. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, that's the crowd. Uh, the crowd loves it. They love it. Uh, that is. I mean, there are. That is one of the better poems we've read, scansion wise and rhyming <laughs> wise, structurally. Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it. It's relatively high quality for a poem about a cartoon fox that someone wants to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that is probably the best cartoon fox fuck poem I have ever seen. I want to the... romance her, thank you. <laughs> so you might think, okay, well, all that stuff has been uh, a little too well written. Um, so at one point on here, someone asks uh, if anyone has ever had dreams of Renamon, like actual for real hmm. dreams. Um, toast? Yes. <laughs> um, you are Eril? I'm Eril. Errol, explain to me your dream, and you do have to read it exactly as it as it was written. <laughs> oh, of course, of course. I wouldn't dream of anything else. <clears throat> well, all happened May 2 of this year. My dream was very realistic, even more than a premonitory dream, but without <laughs> scratching in hyper-realism. <laughs> it was a normal Saturday. In some moment in the morning, I was doing something in the computer. And Whoa. out of nowhere... Whoa. <laughs> The screen turned black, and some symbols start to appear in the screen. <laughs> then, the screen star to turn into a white light, a very bright white. It dazzled me. When the light goes off, I open my eyes. On my right, I see a figure standing by my side. I see a golden fur and tro... Pum okay. <clears throat> and tro -morphic <laughs> vixen. Stanting on her back legs. Then I get real liquid. <laughs> what is that? Even? Realize? What does that Realize? Mean? I what don't does? know. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. Whoa. It's oh. a dog on a skateboard. <laughs> that happened twice because two of us clicked the button at the exact same time. <laughs> I figured. And then I, I guess this is me, Errol, talking. What the Arenamon? <laughs> After seeing Gee, each other dummy. for... <laughs> You're the wrong four kids, dumb. <laughs> uh, Redamon, you're my dreamsicles. 
After seeing each other for a little while, we start to talk. I don't remind what, where we talking about, but like one or two hours later, I think the, my parents may see her and freak out. Then I think that it would be too problematic to hide her and bring her food and all that stuff. So I say, what the hell? I'm going to introduce her to my parents. And Rinamon was like, oh, this is so sudden. <laughs> Meeting your parents so soon. <laughs> when, I I explain, <laughs> when I explain all to them, they seem a little doubtful. <laughs> but they accept her like part of the family. And even she lunch with us on the table. I don't care. Make you into dinner. Come down for lunch there. with us on the table. Good lunch, lunch with us. <laughs> I spent the rest of the day with her. Oh, you just think that's how that's spelled. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Explaining how this world works. Then I realized that all our world is madness. World oh. And even <laughs> teach her a little of reading. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of the day, we were to sleep. My bed is big, so she sleep in my bed. When I fell asleep, I was in a white, blue, infinite vacuum. There was Renamon. When I make visual contact with her, she star to talk. Oh, you're like since two this, dream levels in. Now since she's asleep, talking, she'll sleep again. Since she's talking, I desperately need a <laughs> nutshell to pick it to do the rest of this where she's talking. Um, I guess yes, if, please. I guess if the if the guy shows up, Zarla, you can be the guy. But I really am not clear on who's talking at this point <laughs> in this conversation. <laughs> Uh, this is this this have all been sorry. This have been all a dream. Here I will. Oh, I'm gonna see if I can actually reproduce that voice. I... <laughs> That's fine. If you can, it'll probably be something even better. This have all been a dream. All okay. since you woke up yeah. to the moment you sleep. But this could be real. You just have to find me. Oh, Renamon. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait. If this have been a dream, how do I know that this isn't isn't part nope. of the dream? It, yeah, inst, not, it's not inst, as inst inst. I'm sorry, <laughs> yeah. inst part of the dream. <laughs> she took my hand with her paw, and with a claw, she cut me in a knuckle. Oh. Nucle. Nucle. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that hurts. Why <laughs> d? She put a finger in front of my mouth in signal to shut up. Find me. <laughs> what? Jesus. That is a sexy voice. Though. <laughs> <laughs> that moment I woke up with a pain in my nuclei. I turned on the lights and I had a scar. I was choked. The last time I had thought about her was when I see Digimon on TV like eight years ago or more. Since the dream, I am obsessed with her. I download the entire Syria, Syria, <laughs> and saw it again. And I had another dream with with her, but only because I was thinking about her when I was going to sleep. It was whenst <laughs> whenst <laughs> the same that talked to me. But like three weeks after the dream, I dreamed with her. We were in the roof of my house, seeing the stars. And the out roof. of no, no weir, no weir, <laughs> no weir, she started to sing a song in Japanese. <laughs> I didn't understand anything. Anything. That was her voice. So beautiful. Japanese is such a beautiful language. <laughs> <laughs> she sang Bear Force One and <laughs> found new desires within Paul me. Paul Twitch, she cut his nucleus and that split his atom, causing an explosion. <laughs> that was a very good visual. All right. <laughs> but at the next day, just <laughs> this is Homer. But at the next day, I found in YouTube a song by the pornography of Redemon. <laughs> 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 Oh, God. Okay. I'm sweating. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <sighs> 
But at the next day, I found in YouTube a song by the voice actrices <laughs> that made the voice of Ruki and Renamon in J Japan. When I hear the first solo of Renamon, I get a suprike. It was exactly the suprice. Sorry. Suprice. <laughs> suprice. And suprike, she's back. <laughs> It was exactly the same song in my dream. I'd never heard it before. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. I searched the lyrics, and the part of the song that she sang to me was this. Okay, who wants who wants to sing? Uh, <laughs> I'll do it. I'll do it. Uh, I'll sing. I'll sing. sing. Uh, oh yeah, no nutshell. Yeah. 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 <laughs> the reality is that I met by chance is here, and we <laughs> overcome it all the time. Yeah. Valley of buildings in the penetrating wind. I noticed that something was short. Shoop up, 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 shoop up. about them is that they're all intensely and vividly painful. Come on, fly high. <laughs> You're eight alive. Thank you, Sailor Moon. <laughs> <laughs> That's all the run of mons, I guess, dancing. They're dancing on screen. The kick line. Yeah, the kick line. Hell yeah. Ultra fusion. Ooh, <laughs> more like Ravamon, am I right? <laughs> I don't know. That, that might actually exist. Anyway, <laughs> after analyze this wit, the first dream, I came to a conclusion. Where right. better place to search her that where she talked to me? She want to find she want me to find her in my dreams. Since then, like three weeks ago. Im trying toy have ludic dreams <laughs> without success. Oh, someday. Really good. <laughs> ludic dreams are uh, dreams about ludicrous, by the way. <laughs> uh, I, I thought it was something that I read about on like video game websites 10 years ago when yeah. everyone was trying to be all smart about games. <laughs> <laughs> In this essay on ludic dream dissonance, I will continue with this. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, so um, at the very bottom here, we have a list of comments on Re on Renamon art. It's oh. like very, very bottom here. Um, okay. there, uh, of note is that the artwork itself is not sexual in nature at all, apparently. Yeah. All right. <laughs> just random pictures right. of Renamon. So we can all just go down the line, just everyone just take turns. You can all sure. be DeviantArt commenters like you always wanted to. Thank God. Uh, I'll, I'll do the first one. All right, yeah. <laughs> I'll do the first one. Okay. Give this the aplomb <laughs> it deserves. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Finally! <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> A Renamon without breasts or any of that crap. And you did a wonderful, open quote, job with the detailed fur the shading just perfect eight out of five stars mate and yeah! now that i think about it this drawing holy shit holy shit fuck <laughs> holy fuck. shit fuck <laughs> the unreal tournament holy shit <laughs> Holy shit. The meals. Shit, oh, fuck. Pass and Pepper Incorporated. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost perfect for Rye N. Any chance I could get you to draw a certain Renamon? One with breasts? <laughs> <laughs> and all that crap? And, and all that crap? It's me. It's a dog on a skateboard. <laughs> wow, that was that was a fucking sexy drawing. I can see why I got so yeah, the, excited yeah, the, about that. What a sexy, yeah. sex, <laughs> sexy drawing, man. All right, who's next? Who wants to take the next one? Oh, I'll go next. I'm yeah. really not a Digimon fan. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. oh, well. Yep. But Renamon is so sexy, Big Grin. <laughs> big that happy, is an adorable Renamon. Also, Big Grin. She seems almost dainty in her pose and facial expression. Yet I know there is a heart of determination beneath that fluffy chest. <laughs> okay. When I see this pic, I see Renamon getting ready to defend Connor. Look up my fanfic. Can do. <laughs> we might have already read it, depending on who you are. I don't if know. it's this picture in the stream, that she doesn't look like she's getting ready to do anything. Uh, I think it's a different picture. No, it's just a oh. picture of her standing. I'm trying to stay on top of this. There's lots yeah. of. There's lots of. Oh damn it! I'm trying. <laughs> so many sexy pictures of Renamon. Stop her beautiful tail! 
<laughs> no, that isn't. I thought that she was just making a joke. No, that isn't a stare. Stares at a beautiful tail. Okay. <gasps> Close up picture of her face. I'm. I'm dead. Just dead. Just dead. Yay! I'm moving. I'm moving back. I have no words to describe her beauty. <laughs> Ooh, deviant art. Ooh, yeah. emoji. Like dazzled, dazzled emoji. I guess. I think that emoji is. Oh my god! Oh my god! That one that you were super excited about. Fucking. Oh, uh, look how hot, though. <laughs> it's, it's a Renamon that turned into an iMac. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> which which one? I don't it? know, man. There's lots of pictures here. They're all confusing to me. <laughs> Love at yeah. first diamond sight. <laughs> yeah, the one that that guy was freaking out about is just, oh, she's got a ladybug on her nose. Okay. <laughs> ooh, ooh, I got one here. There you go. OMG, Renamon is my favorite too. I love foxes. Ah, ah. <laughs> I remember when I was a kid, me and my friend had such creative imaginations and we used to fight over who got to be Cubimon XD. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> That's another form she has on the show, by the way. So it's another fo- People who like foxes have a really hard time looking up their favorite animal on the internet. Just. That's true. <laughs> They're really underappreciated. <laughs> uh, Portex, uh, you're you just uh, you like art in general, right? I, not usually, but yeah, I sometimes okay. Okay. dabble. <laughs> just like, As a form of self harm, I will. Like people are people about. are being excited about this particular drawing, and like, mm-hmm. do you have any notes for this particular artist? Is there well, anything, just kind of look into the side. Is there anything you like about like you know some shapes that are colored? <laughs> I mean, you know, it's. Uh, I think it might just be based on the official art. I think it's just based yeah, on the yeah, exact great. same picture we were looking at. Great. <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, that's. I mean, it is extremely sexy. If that's, yeah, yeah. that counts for everything. <laughs> the raw sexual energy of a, <laughs> a pointy head looking in one direction. Uh, yeah, I have uh, a. I, uh, I, oh, yeah, go ahead. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I just have something I want to announce to yep. the chat, to all the F plus audience. Um, <clears throat> Renamon is my spirit animal. Nuff said. <laughs> Nuff said. Nuff said. Uh, I have a I have a super timely reference here, uh, mm-hmm. t- specifically related to this picture. Uh, and my uh, and my uh, my quote is: "I guess I'll paint her like one of the French girls." Mm. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> my, mm. <laughs> Very Never happy goes out of style. <laughs> Why did they add a belly button? I was going to say, was that belly button always there? No, it wasn't. <laughs> Stop your beautiful tail! Whoa, whoa. Wow. That was very repeating. You'd bounce her like a fanboy. Someone goes, so floofy. Mm, so cute. I recognize this pose. It's probably the best pose she has ever done, and it's traced from some Mega Man uh, fan art, so that, or some Mega Man official art, only they also gave her a belly button for some reason, so <laughs> Mega Man X Zero she's got a belly button in this one, too <laughs> Digital belly button, so what would we all would we all learn right before we go, everyone just shout things, random things you learned, we have a minute before we go to the Red <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> <Renamon> is a girl <laughs> uh, I, I would say Renamon is a girl <laughs> Oh, I can absolutely say, like, I understand how Renamon is like a gateway to furry. Like, <laughs> you're not a furry, then you watch Digimon, and then there's this this hourglass shaped uh, bipedal fox, and you're, and you get, and the first boner theory takes hold. And then <laughs> yeah, there you go. you're like, well, I guess this is my life. I am into those. Yeah. <laughs> I'll never grow out of this. <laughs> That's it for me. <laughs> this is a plateau I am sticking with. There's like there's a bunch of Digimon though, right? Oh, there's yeah. like billions, I don't know. There's yeah, a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Just I'm I'm just surprised that this would be the one that would stand out as being the sort of sex object. Well, yeah, Fr- Frank's already playing as the sexiest Kabuterimon with a big hideous bug face. Yeah, is, of, is, it is it like a, a beetle of, that's also a helicopter? Is that what's happening over no, there? It's a it's a beetle that turns into a big scary beetle monster. He's got kind of a predator face when he turns into like a when he gets superpowered. 
I just I I've learned that all Mario Kart games should have boss battles because like look at those fucking <laughs> <laughs> It seems like Frank is having a lot of fun. No, with what what happens is like the boss is invincible, and then randomly like it like has a nap, and that's when you shoot it. <laughs> I'm, I'm I am astonished you have figured that much out. Like. <laughs> <laughs> I, <laughs> what I have learned from uh, a meet in the uh, top secret F plus only chat is that uh, there's a Digimon named Garbage Mon that yeah, looks like yeah. a character from like a 1990s PSA about like don't do drugs or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah literally. Right. Yeah. yeah, really good. Yeah, man does. Yeah. <laughs> so we also have a favorite like Digimon, Mon, like Deathmon. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Evilmon, you know, <laughs> Devilmon. Uh, Devilmon is definitely an action. Yeah, there's Devilmon and there's Demi. De- there's Devimon and De- Demi Devimon. He's tiny. He's adorable. <laughs> oh, Diabromon. There you can see. Yeah, Diab Diaboromon. Puny Digimon. Puny <laughs> <Yeah, laughs> Digimon. You are not. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but he, he helpfully explain how to he does help like not only does he helpfully explain how to beat him but he's also like hey do you want to have fun in a kart racing game and behind <laughs> an object and wait <laughs> <laughs> anyway uh thanks a bunch uh coming up in the next hour uh we've got even more mandela effect that is John Toast being your host for the hour, yep. uh, accompanied by Boots Rangier, Bunny Bread, J.W. Friedman, K. Thor Jensen, and Nutshell Gulag with Positronic on the pens. Uh, mm-hmm. Going to be a fantastic hour. We are coming up to the end. Uh, so many excellent, so many more excellent rewards to give away. So stick around. We will be back in just a moment. Uh... <laughs>